Today's quick tip, talking about the bass part on frevo. The bass part on frevo it's very similar from the bass part on samba. Um, the, on, the only difference is the notes we choose to, to make because they create more melodic lines and samba has the more, a more percussive intention. But the accent is the same. You're gonna play a staccato note at the first tempo and a longer note and more accent accented in the second tempo. So Alright, so pay attention in the articulation and like I said on my life, you can use to make the 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 connection between the chords you can use the notes uh, diatonic notes diatonic notes to connect the chords and you can use chromatic notes to give a a, 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 a little bit spice in your lines I don't exaggerate so much, but I use them to to create more interest on bass. I don't use all the time this chromatic, all right? I hope I have helped you in your process of playing frevo. And to see more about this, just follow me on this channel, the Brazilian Accent Improvisation channel, like Luciano Ruas, underline Brazilian Pianist, on Facebook, YouTube, and you, if you wanna see live on Instagram. Thanks for watching and see you for more quick tips about Brazilian music.